What is going on everybody? Today we are gonna be on the south side of San Antonio, Texas. And what we're gonna be looking at is at the Century Community Homes. This is a community just with Century Homes. And what I really like is that they have so many nice finishing touches and just the design on that, what they have, the exterior of the home where they have stone and all siding throughout. But other than that, we're gonna be taking a look inside at this beautiful four bedroom, two and a half bath that is sitting on almost 2,000 square feet. And we're sitting on almost every lot about 0.25 of an acre. But if you have any questions, if you're looking to relocate down to San Antonio, Texas, we are here to help. I have a team that specializes in relocating families down here to San Antonio, Texas. So if you have any questions, do not hesitate to contact me. We are here to help. But other than that, let's go check it out. As you can tell, with the exterior of the home, you're gonna be having brick, and stone or you can also have siding through all four corners of your home but right when you walk in we're going to be introduced to this beautiful white all white paint throughout the whole home and what you're going to be having is some granite countertops throughout and some white cabinetry as well and what i like is that it's an open concept with your island in the middle to where you also have stools where you can have just people come over and just have a drink and where you also have your dining and your living area in the same place. So this is what I really like because this is where we can host family reunions, just have some fun with families, friends, especially when you have parties. This is a great place to be because you're also gonna have bedrooms upstairs and the master all by itself. And right now we're gonna be taking a look outside. Oh, and as you can see, we have some good filters. What's going on everybody? So let me just ask y'all, what do y'all see in the new construction world right now? So right now, what I see in the new construction world are amazing opportunities for first time home buyers, second time home buyers, and third time home buyers. Uh, for example, you're getting all your closing costs paid uh, compared to about a year ago where you had to pay your closing costs, down payment, you're paying $50,000 over the asking price. Now you're actually paying realistic prices, getting all of your closing costs paid, interest rate buy downs, the whole nine yards. I feel like it's a great time to buy right now. I do too. What do you think, Mr. Don Tubbs? What do you think? I'm just gonna have to hit every point that uh, Ty the realtor over there had hit. You know, this is a great time to buy and I think you guys should get back to listening to Money Man Abel. I appreciate that, thank you, thank you. But let's go keep a take a look at the inside of the home. And what you're gonna be having is also with the texture of this home, it's gonna be the Monterrey texture. That's what I really like because it just gives you a lot more to pop out. But right now, we're gonna be taking a look at the master bedroom. And as you can see, this is a very spacious master bedroom to where you can have just some type of, um, what's it called? You can have some either backsplash of brick or you can have a backsplash of some wood paneling or you can just have some texture up on there. And then with here in your home, here's gonna be the master bath to where you have your double vanity sinks with your court man-made and you're also gonna have a glass walk-in shower. And then over here, you're gonna be having your toilet but with the door so the sink won't be getting out, that's the best part. We gotta make sure it stays in one place. And here is gonna be your master closet. It is a little bit small but it is very spacious to where you can walk in and just Honestly, us men, we, we can really just do as much as possible. We, we, don't, have, we don't need much to, to make sure everything's roomy. And then here's just a little closet to where you can store your towels, all your medicines, all the cabinetry. And now we're going to be taking a look upstairs. But just absorb the interior one more time. This is a great place just to, like I said, have some fun with friends, family. And over here, you are going to be having your half bath. And I really just, really just like the wallpaper that they have in the back. So there's a I'll lot of different types of wallpaper that you can do with this home. It's very beautiful. And then over here, you're going to be having a spacious uh, washer and dryer, a vanity room to where you can just store as many things as possible, it. store as much as possible. And this is where you're going to have your garage, but this is where the sales reps are at at the moment. And then here, you're just going to have a little... Harry Potter closet, very neat, just to store your, your utilities. And now, as you can tell, this is where you're also gonna have your pantry, so it's pretty spacious, very nice. You can store all your favorite foods in there. 
And now we're going to be taking a look upstairs to where you're going to be having carpet all throughout the upstairs. So that's what I like. You're going to have carpet in your bedrooms and on the upstairs. But on the first floor, you're just going to be having all vinyl flooring to where once it, if there's anybody that has muddy shoes, well, you can definitely clean that up really quickly. And then here we have a little closet just to have some game rooms. You can have checkers, chess. You can do a lot of things with this. You can have tic-tac-toe. You can have Connect Four, and just check out how spacious it is. This is definitely the right place to store all the kids when they're getting too loud. This is the best place for them to be. And what they're going to be having is two bedrooms that are a 14 by 12. And this just gives you a pretty layout of what they do. And as you can see with the structure that they have, that what the paneling that they have done i really like this because i'm actually doing this on a home but on the exterior of it but what i really like is that they added it on the inside so it's very neat and here you have your walk-in closets so very spacious very nice so let me know what you guys think of this home on a scale of one to five like i said the price point on these homes it's between anywhere from the 230s all the way up to the 330s so let me know what you guys think. And here, this is another bedroom. It's a 10 by 10. This can be for the youngest, very spacious. So if you have any questions wondering if uh, they have the certain floor plans or just what tailors to your family's needs. So if you have any three kids or if you have two kids, we can definitely find you a home with the affordability. And here you have your double vanity sinks to where you your kids won't have to be fighting over which sink they're going to take because they have enough elbow room to do that. And then here your walk-in shower with its own little tub and then right here this can be for the favorite this can be this is the gonna be the biggest room this is a 10 by 15 very spacious and it just gives you a little idea of how your rooms can come out with your kids we know how they love to design and just make the room as homey as possible so let me know what you guys think that concludes this end of the tour. And if you have any questions, like I said, we can definitely help you out in just finding the best home for you, for your family, for your needs. And if you're looking to relocate down to San Antonio, do not hesitate to contact me. We can definitely help you out. But other than that, I hope you have a blessed one.